Good morning, everyone. Today is Wednesday, July 3rd, 2024, and this is our daily bread. The title is Glorifying God in My Life. It's from John chapter 17, verses 1 through 5, and the key verse is verse 1. It says, After Jesus said this, he looked toward heaven and prayed, Father, the hour has come. Glorify your Son, that your Son may glorify you. After Jesus said this, he looked toward heaven and prayed, Father, the hour has come. Glorify your Son, that your Son may glorify you. For you granted him authority over all people, that he might give eternal life to all those you have given him. Now this is eternal life, that they know you, the only true God and Jesus Christ, whom you have sent. I have brought you glory on earth by finishing the work you gave me to do. And now, Father, glorify me in your presence with the glory I had with you before the world began. Daily Bread First, Live for God's Glory Jesus' prayer before his crucifixion teaches us that our ultimate goal should be to glorify God in all we do. He chose to honor God, even at the cost of his own life. He focused on the eternal outcome rather than the immediate gain. This attitude should guide our priorities and actions. As college students, choose daily to make decisions that reflect your commitment to God, not just your personal ambitions. Whether it's in your studies, relationships, or campus activities, ask yourself if your actions honor God. Are you living in a way that brings glory to God, or are you moving away from Him? When making decisions, think about which choice best shows your faith and glorifies God. 1 Corinthians 10.31 says, So whether you eat or drink or whatever you do, do it all for the glory of God. Let's live to glorify God. Second, eternal perspective. Jesus was able to endure the immediate pain of the cross because he focused on the eternal joy and restoration it would bring. Understanding that what we do now affects eternity can transform how we handle every situation from difficulties to success. When challenges arise, whether academic pressures, personal conflicts, or future uncertainties, maintain an eternal perspective. Remind yourself that every hardship can strengthen you and bring you closer to God. Our hope is not in this world, but in our eternal home in heaven. When we seek to learn from every experience and trust that God uses them for our ultimate good and His glory, we can live with confidence. Where are you putting your hope in today, in God or this world? Let's pray. Heavenly Father, empower me to live a life that glorifies you. Help me to maintain an eternal perspective, valuing the eternal over fleeting pleasures or gains. May my life on campus and beyond reflect your love and truth. Help me remember that my true home is with you in heaven. In Jesus' name, amen. One word, I will live to glorify God.